Hi, I'm Cody Darkstalker, and this is my second video for the Bat Cat video blog. Um, today we're supposed to be talking about our fashion and what type of goth we are, and like lists or shows and things that like represent us stylistically. Um, I'm at the boy person's house again because my computer is still having identity issues as far as like the fact that it's supposed to be a computer and do what I tell it to instead of doing what it wants to, which at this stage is using my camera to create modern art out of blurs and blobs and shadowy, creepy stuff. I don't know. Probably needs therapy. But for the time being, we will be filming here. Fantastic location. This is his bed because, like, there's not a lot of room. But, um, okay, fashion. Um, I just wear a lot of black. I don't have, like, a specific type of goth that I necessarily identify with, other than, I guess I like some new goth stuff, um, I like a little bit of things from, like, the metal community that they're really into, I like some, I like a little bit from a lot of things, I like some of the fetish wear, um, let's see, things that define my style, my hair, I guess, it's usually short right now, it's, like, it's kind of, like, down to, like, here, but it's pinned up, because it's, a, I guess I can, like, show it, it's a god-awful mess. Got a lot of product because I don't really care to do anything with my hair lately. You can see, look, red hair. I recently dyed it black. Um, I actually have another blog, and you can see it was like reddish for a while, but it was getting all faded and gross. And the boy person was like, "Let's shave your head again." Um, I had a mohawk for a while. I've had it half shaved and half long. I've had it mostly buzzed. I've done a lot of weird things. I get bored really easily, but uh, I guess that's like one very like noticeable gothy thing about me it's usually i have like kind of weird hair i'm digging my buzz cut right now on this side um let's see the other thing that's like a big thing for my fashion is i have a lot of piercings you can kind of see look i have my septum i have a little stud here I've got two studs in my eyebrow gauges i think i'm up to like a four now i'm in the middle not stopping here. And another second hole. Flip rings. I forgot other things, other places that Sean Hoppy talked about. <laughs> um, in terms of like clothing, I'm kind of laid back with it. I wear a lot of tank tops. Like I have like a whole drawer that's nothing but guys size small and extra small ribbed black tank tops. Um, if you hear weird noises, the boy person is literally sleeping on the floor because I've taken over his bed. He apparently wants to take a nap before we watch the human centipede. Um, yeah, that's what I'm doing with my evening. How about you? Mm -hmm. Oh god, that was terrible. Um, I wear a collar at all times. It's an eternity collar. I am a part of the uh, BDSM scene as well as the goth scene. So there's this baby. It's really cool. It's got like a little hidden uh, place where like an Allen key goes that takes it off and like the hinge is hidden. Uh, surgical steel, so it's really nice because I actually have metal allergies despite all the metal in my body. Um, I also have this little bird skull necklace that I wear a lot. I had to put it on this little cord because I had like an allergic reaction to the chain, but this is fine. Uh, got this for my birthday, and then just recently I picked up this little cutie. It's adorable again because I like a lot of stuff in the metal scene. Um, these I got in St. Mark's. They're a little like kind of like a bat design going on here. Leather cuffs, little studs. I can't wear them all the time because like, again, like this little tiny bit of metal and all of a sudden I get like an allergic reaction. Um, God. Uh, this shirt is something that I actually like, customized. It's like actually like a little three quarter sweater and I just taped something to cross onto it. It's really comfy. Um, and it's black so that's good. I'm really like, I'm a lazy goth. I don't have layers of like lace and fishnets. I don't really have, I have like two pairs of striped stockings. One was for a Halloween costume and I haven't really worn them since and the other pair I just like never, I wore them like once. Cause like when I have one white and black that's like really thick and one black and purple. Which I need to wear more, like I keep saying that. Um, I do have fuzzy leg warmers that I like. They're black furry ones. Which I got cause I have like platform sneakers and like creepers. I'm really big on um, shoes. I don't really have anything, I feel really bad that I don't have anything to show you. Um, shoe wise I have black creepers, I have like flat black boots, I have cowboy boots that are like dark red. They're not really goth at all, but um, when I'm not dressing in goth, I also dress in like 
some punk and grunge influenced things and cowboy boots are just really comfy. I don't know if you know that, but they're really comfy. I also have a short pair of like grey cowboy boots that I'll wear with like cut stuff because I'm just like, I don't even give a damn. Hate is gonna hate on my cowboy boots, but I'm really comfortable so I don't even care and they're easy to throw on because um, in addition to being a goth, I'm an art major, which means I spend a lot of my day getting really, really filthy. I need to kind of be comfortable because I'm like elbow deep in clay and like paint and ink and charcoal dust. So like nice clothes don't really work for that. So it's a lot of like wake up in the morning, throw on a tank top, throw on leggings, throw on a sweater. I wear cardigans like 900% of the time. It's like short black cardigan that's like hip length or long black cardigan. And then I have this black cardigan and this black cardigan and this black cardigan. And like, no, it's bad. I have a lot of cardigans. So I only have like three... Black. I have four black ones. One of them has like a hood, so it's like I'm in between on that. And then I have like 800 pairs of black tights in various stages of decay. Um, I'm not a really cool kid who rips their tights on purpose or wears ripped tights because, like, I think it's super awesome. Although I do like the style. Um, I'm just really stupid and clumsy and I can't ever manage to not destroy things. Um, other things that I have on hand. Oh, I have, this is like my favorite shirt and I wear it way too much for it to be okay. But I got it from, there's tiny hair on it, Nikki Lipstick. Yeah, pentagram, tank top. And then it like, I don't know if you can see it. Uh, it's backward for you. It says give him hell on the back, which I think is kind of cute. Um, actually, I was in the other video. I have a bandana that I wear like a little too much because, and this is going to sound really gross. I don't wash my hair a lot. I, I use bar shampoo. So I only have to wash my hair like every like three days. Like I bathe, but like I take baths, so I don't really wash my hair. And what's really weird about this bandana is like it looks like it's gray, but it's really not. This is the reverse crappy side of a print. And uh, the reason this looks correct, you guys, is because in real life it's backward. Because it's supposed to be bright blue, and I don't do the bright blue. So I wrap it up, and I'm like, yeah, look, it's a black and gray bandana. It's not... I'm, I'm that sad. Um, aside from that, I have, oh, I have my purse, which is kind of cute, actually. So it's got little, like, chain details all over it. I got it Forever 21. Like, a lot of my clothes are from Forever 21, except for lately, a lot of my t-shirts are hand-me-down from my boyfriend. And then I, like, turn them into tank tops. I cut the sleeves and neckline out of everything, because I don't really like wearing a lot of clothes. So it's like, I'm just gonna wear this cut-up tank top and a cardigan and shorts and boots and black tights like that's pretty much what I do and apparently a lot of that is considered like new goth or neo grunge so I'm just like oh okay that's cool I'm cool with that I don't really want to argue with anybody I wear scarves a lot I'm such a hipster sometimes but it's not a hipster thing it's a you can't really see it but I have like boob shelf so like you cut the neck out of something and all of a sudden it's like oh, this is my bra by the way this is it's actually a, a big part of my wardrobe because it hangs out a lot. It's a cami bra. Check it. So, this is me a lot of the time. So, in order to avoid the whole, hey, boys, want to have some fun? It's the scarf. It's like a boob armor panel. I don't know how to describe it. It's my boob shield. You know, I just kind of drape it. And I'm like, oh, yeah. Because I can't always have a rabbit perching right here. So, in the event that Mochi isn't with me. I don't know if any of you actually watched my other video. There was a rabbit. He's in this cage right now looking at me like, Mommy, why am I not with you? Because he pooped in the laundry basket. That's why he's not with me. It was dirty laundry, though, so don't be like, Oh, God, this person's terrible. She doesn't wash her hair, and she's all like, Ugh, and rabbit poops everywhere. No, it's not that bad. It's, it's dirty laundry, and you're going to get the poop out. And rabbit poops are like, This isn't a discussion about that. It doesn't matter. Um, I'm trying to see if I have like anything else to like show. I'm really really ghetto right now that's pretty much it um in terms of fashion i've been really lazy lately i've been like i used to wear heels all the time and lately it's been like i got like those pair of, they're not toms they're knock off the toms because i'm not even cool enough to have toms in black and then i got a pair of like leopard print loafers because i'm like this is legit i got a pair of moccasin boots at american eagle i'm not even gonna lie i was like these look comfy as fuck boom purchase they showed up in my house and i'm like oh, let me hold you i have like seven inch platform damania boots that never get worn because they're disintegrating 
so apparently the universe doesn't want me to have cool goth shoes. I have like, like I said, I have, I have creepers. They're not Demonia. They're um, they're from some weird shady place in Saint Mark's that like didn't like have like labels on their stuff. Cause I get a lot of stuff from like St. Mark's and thrift stores, and then I get a lot of stuff from the mall. I'm a big Forever Twenty One person. It's like I'm gonna go to Forever Twenty One and just buy a bunch of black shorts. Yay! Although actually, my last purchase was at Walmart. Totally got Walmart shorts. Wore them with tights. And I'm like from Walmart. Walmart tights with Walmart black athletic shorts. And I went out like that because I'm a boss. So that's it. I wear a lot of like mini skirts and stuff. I don't know what style you consider that. Somewhere between like new goth and trad goth and just generally gothy spookiness. I don't know. I don't know. I'm so sorry. This is terrible. Um, maybe next time I'll have something to show you guys that isn't just that. In the meantime, I I hope you enjoyed this little foray into my sad sad sartorial choices, and that's that. Okay. Goodbye.